How much do I love yogurt's health benefits? Let me count the ways. Why do Americans eat over a million cups of yogurt a year? What the heck is so great about it? We've got to start with its amazing history. Yogurt's been around in one form or another for thousands of years. Opa. But it wasn't until the 1970s when everyone in America was obsessing about health food that yogurt became really popular. The largest yogurt manufacturing plant in the world produces 230,000 cups of yogurt per hour. So how much do I love yogurt's health benefits? Let me count the ways. Yogurt's a great source of calcium and protein. A typical six ounce cup of yogurt provides 25 to 30% of your daily calcium needs. And that same six ounce serving of traditional yogurt delivers seven to nine grams of protein. And the bacteria that are used to make yogurt, they bring a whole new set of benefits to the table. Some brands are treated with specific strains of bacteria called probiotics that might help boost immune function, improve regularity, and combat various digestive disorders, although the benefits are still under study. And last but not least, regularly eating yogurt can help fight bad breath, presumably because the good cultures in yogurt combat odor-causing bad guys in your mouth. Now as far as your waistline goes, non-fat and fat-free yogurt has no fat. Low fat has a couple of grams, three grams or less per serving, but regular full fat yogurt clocks in at around nine grams of fat per cup. And that is bad news for your waistline. As far as the sugar content goes, don't immediately freak out when you see a high number on the back of the container. Some of that sugar comes from lactose sugar, which is naturally found in milk. On the other hand, you do need to worry about the amount of sugar in the flavored yogurts. That's because on top of the natural sugar, there's extra sugar coming from fruit and sweeteners like corn syrup, evaporated cane juice, sugar, honey, fruit juice concentrate, along with other stuff. So when it comes to flavored yogurts, you want to choose non-fat or low-fat flavored yogurts with less than 20 grams of total sugar per serving. And how about the hype around Greek yogurt? They already account for about 25% of total yogurt sales in the United States. So why the popularity? Well, it's a texture thing. Mm. Even the Greek non-fat varieties have this super rich, creamy mouthfeel because of the unique straining process which removes the watery whey from the yogurt. Greek yogurt has twice as much protein as regular yogurt. Of course, non-fat Greek yogurt has no fat, that's obvious. But when you move up to the whole milk, you're scarfing down 10 grams, seven which are saturated. That's more than most regular ice creams, yikes. So is it kitchen worthy? Without a doubt. Just be sure to stick with non-fat or low-fat varieties and keep the sugar in check. Now that you know what the heck you're eating, don't forget to enjoy every creamy, light, and luscious bite. Mm. If you want to see more What the Heck Are You Eating next week, subscribe now. And don't forget to watch Fitness Guinea Pig, where we test today's hottest workout and diet trends.